Hello, today we're going to take a look at Welsh Melody. This is a, um, a piece on the Grade 3 Trumpet Syllabus. Um, some of you may be preparing this for your Grade 3 exams. Um, if you're new to this piece, don't worry, we're going to have a little look at any tricky bits, any bits I recommend you take a little look at. Um, so hopefully this will be a big help to you. Um, the book's from Scaly Winners by Peter Lawrence. Um, the tune itself, Welsh Melody, um, the piece is actually called My Hen Will Advan Had I, um, or in English, um, that's Land of My Fathers. It's the Welsh National Anthem. Um, you'd hear this piece performed all over in Wales. Um, big ceremonies, you hear it sometimes at concerts, big sporting events like the Six Nations Rugby Tournament or the Rugby World Cup when that's on. Um, so you can hear it at events like that. Of course, you can also hear the tune on YouTube. Um, and if you're curious about the words, um, which of course are in Welsh, you can also probably find those on YouTube if you ask mum and dad. Um, so let's take a little look at this piece. Um, so first of all, the piece, it's in E flat major. So if we look at our key signature, um, just here, we need to be where we've got three flats. We've got B flat, E flat, and A flat. So remember, you, you always need to play those notes. We're also in three, four. We start with the upbeat. So the, the first thing you need to do, once you've checked out your key signature and your time signature and you're ready to play, before you play, just think, one, two, and then you're in on three. One, two, da, 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 da. Okay, that's the first thing to do. Just make sure that you're in time. Um, I said this is um, the Welsh National Anthem and you hear it sung um, with much passion and pride. Um, it can get quite loud in the real version. Now, we start quite loud at mezzo forte, um, we have a crescendo here. I would come up to forte, keep it forte here, um, and then we're going to diminuendo back down to mezzo forte. I, I wouldn't go any lower than that. Um, and we stay there right until here, and then we're going to crescendo back up to forte. We're quite high here. Same here as well, these moments where forte... Um, we're quite high. We're on our E flat, so make sure you're using plenty of fast air and tight corners to get up there because otherwise you might under pitch and end up getting a B instead of an E flat. So lots of fast air, please. Um, we diminuendo again back down to mezzo forte and we stay there. Now in the national anthem, this is the beginning of the chorus. Um, so these notes that you can see this marking above the B flat, remember it's a B flat because of our key signature, first valve, um, the marking above is a pause so you can take your time on that. And the next note is a pause. Um, we're also forte. This needs to be nice and big. The words at this point are glad, glad. Now, glad in Welsh means land. Um, it's talking, singing about the land. Um, so you can take your time nice and big on these. Really enjoy it. And then we come back in time here. Um, drop down to mezzo forte. We've got another crescendo here. We're going to come from mezzo forte up to forte again. Remember, lots of fast air because we're on a high note E flat. We want to make sure that we get up to that E flat. Um, and then we're going to come back down again to mezzo forte. Um, another thing to be careful of in this piece, there's quite a few um, moments where we have to think about our articulation. Here, here, and here, here. We've got another one here, um, here, here, and here. Now, they're slurred. Remember, you're always going to tongue the first note when you see notes slurred like this. So that C, that's going to be tongued, but the D will be slurred. It's really important to, to make that difference. Um, if you don't do the articulation, the piece can be very boring. And it's such a lovely tune. Um, we don't want it to be boring. Um, so it's really important that we put that articulation in there. So every time you see this, the first note is tongued. The second note is slurred. Okay, bear that in mind. Please always remember that. Um, in terms of tempo, it says steadily. You can you can do this um, nice and steady. Don't go too fast. If if you go too fast, it's going to ruin it. Um, the tune, my hen lad vernadai. That's your speed, okay? And that was me trying to sing in Welsh. Um, so um, 
make sure you don't go too fast. Mm-hmm. 